Tiger here, and I got another video in my Nate Diaz Road to the Title UFC in the Speed Series. And yeah, I'm trying to keep up with this series, trying to see how far I can get with Nate Diaz. And this is the last time I'm going to make this like a commentary. I'm going to start doing like live commentaries for this series now because it's a Let's Play series. So yeah, this is going to be like the last formal commentary, I guess. And we're going to go into live commentaries and you guys can see my reaction, what I do when I fight. But yeah. Here we're versing Donald Cerrone in the lightweight bout, still on the UFC Fight Night card. To, if you don't know, the UFC Fight Night cards are like the free shows. They're the um, fights that you see free on TV, so not really the marquee fights, not really pay-per-view fights that everybody wants to see. But yeah, a little spoiler alert, this is going to be going into the, the um, uh, going into the third round, I believe. And yeah, I made this, I recorded this a while ago, so I don't really remember everything that happened. But yeah, I'm just getting used to Nate Diaz, didn't really, don't really use him that much. And I just want to talk about the real UFC, really, which, um, there's going to be a, the um, next UFC pay-per-view is coming on May 22nd. And if you guys never watch UFC before, they put up free fights at least once every mo every month, there's a free fight card, there's tons of fights you can find online, especially on YouTube, there are free fights that you guys check out, please, just watch MMA, it's a very good sport, and the next card, if you're just looking to watch a card, the next card is stacked, the heavyweight title is online, the former heavyweight champion is fighting, just the whole, the whole card is just Heavyweight, 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 heavyweight. It's just, just um, it's just gonna be a good time, really, because who doesn't like watching heavyweights fight? They usually knock each other out. They usually just destroy each other. But yeah, UFC 146, I believe, it's gonna be headlined. Junior Dos Santos, the current heavyweight champion. If you don't know, look him up. I watch some of his fights. The guy has like lights out boxing skills versus Frank Mir, who is the guy that beat Brock Lesnar. His first Brock Lesnar's first ever fight a fight in the UFC. He tapped out Brock Lesnar. But yeah, the whole main card this is heavyweight, it's a stack top to bottom. They do free fights on Facebook too. You guys can check out the free fights on Facebook right before a pay per view goes live. And then even on FX just just before a pay per view comes on. They do free fights on FX. So yeah, it's gonna be a stacked card. I suggest if you've never watched any type of MMA or UFC, you at least check out the free Facebook fights that they're gonna put up right before the pay per view goes up. And if you're interested in the pay per view, I watch a pay per view I I usually watch a pay-per-view at least once every month. I'm actually going to a UFC event in June when they come to New Jersey. Can't wait for that. I've actually met a UFC fighter before, actually, but I'll get into that a little bit later. But, yeah, part of the reason I want to start making this live commentary is because I want you guys to see my reactions and what I do. And I think it will be more fun if you guys get to like see it like that, I believe. So, yeah. I, d I want more people to start playing this game because this game is a, r a really, really solid game, I believe. And there's not really that big of an audience for it in YouTube, I know. It's not really people are, people don't really, like, know much about UFC or MMA in general. So if I can just get people to watch it and enjoy the game and just like the game as much as I do, then I think that will be a really big success. But yeah, I'm enjoying playing the series. I'm going to start recording the last video I put up in the series. Didn't really get that many views, but I'm just uh, I'm just seeing where I can get, really. I'm just, I, knew, I knew coming in this wasn't going to get as big as of audience as my Madden videos, but I'm hoping that my subscribers still enjoy the series. And, and in the last video I put up, I got a few comments that people were starting to get interested in MMA, so hopefully people are transitioning 
to MMA and start watching it because really, if you, I can understand if you don't want to pay $50, $60 for pay-per-views each month, but they put up free cards on Fox, on FX, on Facebook, on YouTube. You can fight free fights everywhere, basically. So if you if you want to learn more about the sport, just watch the free fights. I can link some uh, some fights in the description. Um. And that's on YouTube because the, even on the UFC's personal YouTube channel, they always put up free fights. They're, they're really big into the free fights thing. So yeah, I'm, uh, I'm gonna do that. But uh, yeah, I'm fighting Donald Cerrone here. He's uh, he's a very tough fighter in real life. Now so I'm gonna be fighting him. I was fighting him for my second fight ever, but yeah, he took uh, he. I went the distance with him pretty much I fought all three rounds of uh, him I believe I believe this this fight went all three rounds and I took his best shots so yeah gonna keep going till Nate Diaz loses or he wins the title do you guys want me to end the series if I lose or what yeah I just want to see what you guys think about this whole series it's a learning experience I have fun playing the game and I just want to see if you guys like playing this, uh, like watching me play this game, and like these commentaries, because really, I enjoy making these videos. And if you guys don't like it, then obviously I'm not gonna put it out. But, but yeah, I just think it's nice to have a change of pace from all these football, football man videos. And I do love making football videos. That's my favorite kind of video. But it's always good to have something different, change it up a little bit. And yeah probably get a new audience out there and hopefully these videos and people start enjoying and saying hey look i'm gonna play this game this game looks pretty fun there's free demos on the, P the ps uh, and the playstation network and the xbox live marketplace so check out the demo download it you guys will have tons of fun with it just like i did two years ago when i first picked up ufc 2009 I just downloaded the demo and look where I'm at now. I was top 10 in the game battles before, top 100 in the world in UFC 2010. Not re not really in the competitive scene. UFC 3 just playing casually, but do have a pretty good ranked record if I say so myself. Before the leaderboards got reset, of course. But yeah, just took a quick sip there. But yeah, win the third round. Let's fight the last round. If you guys don't know, MMA for non-title fights, it's three five-minute rounds, and the judges score the fights basically like who did the most damage, who had the more control, who was like pushing the pace of the fight, things like that. So. Mm. If you if you're like pushing the pace and keep like going after your opponent, like hitting him with good strikes, taking him down, doing all the fancy stuff, basically, then you're gonna win the fight. Which I tried mixing it up. I tried hitting him with the right amount of shots, and you see, I end up rocking down to Rooney here. But he's a he's a tough fighter. I wasn't able to finish him there. Usually, I finish my opponents after putting putting them. Beating on them like that, but see the submission game. You have to watch out fighting the computer on ultimate, like like I do, like because sometimes they you can have them rocked, you can have them dazed, you can have them all, everything, and they can just pull out the freaking craziest submission anywhere. But yeah, you see, I knock him out here. Third round took me long enough, but yeah, Nate Diaz continues. Coming for that title, building up in the ranks. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Check you guys later. Please remember to leave a like, leave a comment. Tell me what you guys think about this series. If you want me to continue, just tell me. I enjoy making these videos, and as long as you guys watch it, I'll keep producing them. But yeah, guys, Nate Diaz continues his run throughout the